Flames were already spewing out of two manholes at Myrtle and Grand Avenues by the time firefighters arrived at 10 o'clock last night. No one was injured, but it caused power outages to more than 150 customers. Oh, it was horrible. It's cold and like we just lit a ton of candles and played cards because that's all we could do. Con Edison crews worked through the night, going from manhole to manhole to conduct repairs, but the job took longer than expected. I definitely thought it would be up and running by this morning, but uh, I guess not. Many residents who live on Grand Avenue woke up this morning with no electricity, heat, and some didn't have hot water. I managed to shower before everything happened last night, so we still had hot water. Um, but my boyfriend went down to the gym. Um, he's going to just shower there after his morning workout and get ready there. Con Ed says the manhole fires were caused by defective cables. Crews had to replace them and also fix any other damage that was caused. I think it's probably better that it happened on a Sunday night because we don't have to be in the house all day. Today, we're going off to work. It was an especially cold night for Idalia Kaplan, who fears crews will still be working when she returns home. I'm dreading going back to my room after going to the gym. Like, it's going to be tough. And according to Con Ed's website, power should be restored by 1 o'clock this afternoon. But I have to tell you, we've been checking that website all day, and the times have changed many times. Reporting live in the Clinton Hill section of Brooklyn, Andrea Klein-Thomas, CBS 2 News.